Singera Chennai 2.0, Sightsee the Sea from a Ropeway, Marina Beach Ropeway Project. The Chennai Marina Beach Ropeway Project, also referred to as the Besan Nagar Ropeway Project, is an ambitious infrastructure initiative aimed at boosting tourism and easing traffic congestion in one of Chennai's most iconic locales. This RS-285 core project is designed to span 4.6 kilometers, connecting Marina Beach with Besant Nagar, featuring a station at an intermediate point. This video provides an in-depth analysis of the project by delving into the historical context, planning, technical details, implementation strategy, and progress, within the larger framework of India's National Ropeways Development Program. Details for this video has been gathered from various news reports of June 2, 2024, January 24, 2024 and January 2, 2023. Hi friend! Welcome back to SciTech Buzz One channel. We wish to sincerely thank all the new subscribers of this channel. We have observed that 97% of our returning viewers, more than 18,000 in number and first-time viewers totaling more than 75,000 in number, haven't subscribed to our channel. If you haven't as yet subscribed, kindly consider doing so, after watching this video, since it would help us reach our first self-set target of 10,000 subscribers and encourage us to do more. Watch this interesting video until the end so that you will not miss out on all the details. Historical Context and Initial Planning Early Proposals and Government Involvement The idea of establishing a ropeway in Chennai is not new and it dates back to 2022 under the Singera Chennai 2.0 initiative by the Greater Chennai Corporation. The initial proposal, spearheaded by Ward 104 Councillor T.V. Shimozi, envisaged a shorter route from Napier Bridge to Vivekananda House. This concept, however, did not advance beyond the proposal stage. Subsequently, a more extensive plan was developed by the National Highways Logistics Management Limited, NHLML, an arm of the National Highways Authority of India, NHAI. This new plan aimed to create a 4.6 km ropeway connecting Marina Beach with Besant Nagar, gaining the state government's in-principle clearance and alignment approval. The primary objectives of this project include Enhancing tourism by offering a scenic and efficient transportation option between two of Chennai's most popular beach destinations. Reducing urban traffic congestion by providing an alternative mode of transport. Project development and strategic planning. Feasibility studies and clearances. Following the lifting of the Model Code of Conduct, NHLML is set to prepare a detailed feasibility report for the project. This report is crucial as it will pave the way for inviting bids for the project's implementation. The feasibility study will address several critical aspects, including market demand, traffic surveys, topography, and the assessment of various ropeway technologies. Additionally, the project will require Coastal Regulation Zone, CRZ, clearance from the Ministry of Environment, Forest, and Climate Change, due to its proximity to the coastline. This study report, crucial for moving forward and will be followed by bid invitations. Economic Viability and Public-Private Partnership The project is poised to be implemented through the hybrid annuity mode, which involves a blend of public and private funding. Under this model, NHLML will provide 60% construction support, a significant increase from the 40% typically offered for national highway projects. This enhanced support is intended to attract more private players, ensuring the project's economic viability and encouraging investments. Technical Specifications and Infrastructure Ropeway Technology and Capacity The Marina Beach Ropeway will utilize monocable detachable gondola MDG, systems. These systems are renowned for their efficiency, safety, and capability to handle substantial passenger volumes. Each gondola cabin will have a capacity of 10 persons, designed to offer a comfortable and panoramic view of the surrounding areas. The MDG technology ensures smooth operation with detachable cabins that allow for efficient boarding and alighting. Modern ropeway systems are equipped with safety features such as emergency brakes, backup power, and regular maintenance checks, ensuring a safe and smooth journey for passengers. The entire project is expected to take two years to complete, 
contingent on timely land acquisition and clearance approvals. Environmental Considerations and Land Acquisition The implementation of the project will necessitate the acquisition of certain parcels of land and obtaining multiple environmental clearances. These steps are critical but could potentially delay implementation. Given its coastal location, the project must comply with stringent environmental regulations, particularly the CRZ norms. This ensures that the development is sustainable and does not adversely impact the coastal ecosystem. Broader National Context, Parvatmala Pariyajana Overview and Objectives the Marina Beach Ropeway Project is part of the expansive Parvatmala Pariyajana, unveiled by Union Minister for Road Transport and Highways, Nitin Gudkari. This national initiative aims to develop over 200 ropeway projects across India with an investment of 1.25 rupees lakh crore over the next five years. The program is designed to enhance connectivity, promote tourism, and provide a viable urban transport alternative. Economic Impact and Growth Trajectory Gudkari emphasizes the transformative potential of ropeways in India's economic landscape. He underscores the necessity of reducing project costs and promoting indigenous manufacturing under the Make in India initiative, standardizing policies and codes to streamline development and to make ropeways economically viable. The initiative aligns with India's broader economic ambitions of becoming a 5 trillion US dollars economy, focusing on time-bound, cost-efficient, qualitative, and sustainable infrastructure development. Hybrid Annuity Mode and Investment Under the Parvatmala Pariyajana, the Hybrid Annuity Mode, HAM for Ropeways, is a strategic move to attract private investment by offering substantial construction support. This approach is expected to foster a robust network of ropeways, enhancing connectivity and spurring economic growth. The initiative also includes collaboration with industry leaders, technology providers, and infrastructure developers to promote Make in India and localize ropeway component manufacturing. The increased support from the government is a clear signal to private investors of the project's viability and potential for profitability. Symposium and Stakeholder Engagement Industry Collaboration and Technological Advancements In January 2024, a Symposium Come exhibition was held to highlight the National Ropeways Development Program. This event brought together Indian and global stakeholders, including manufacturers, technology providers, concessionaires, infrastructure developers and featured discussions between them. The symposium emphasized the importance of industry collaboration in promoting advanced ropeway technologies and the localization of components. Awards and Recognitions During the symposium, the Bijli Mahadev Ropeway Project in Himachal Pradesh and the Dosi Hill Ropeway Project in Haryana were awarded. These projects exemplify successful implementation and potential impact on tourism and connectivity. The event also featured the signing of a Memorandum of Understanding, MAO, between NHLML and IIT Roorkee to establish a center of excellence for ropeways and innovative mobility systems. Promoting Public Convenience The symposium concluded with discussions on promoting wayside amenities to improve public convenience. This aspect is crucial for ensuring that the ropeway systems are not only efficient but also user-friendly and accessible. The exhibition showcased state-of-the-art ropeway technologies, highlighting the significant role they will play in India's economic growth and infrastructure development. Current Status and Future Prospects Detailed Feasibility Report and Bidding Process As of June 2024, NHLML is preparing the Detailed Feasibility Report for the Marina Beach Ropeway Project. This report is expected to address various technical, environmental, and economic aspects of the project. Once the report is finalized, the bidding process will commence, attracting potential contractors and investors. The project will seek necessary environmental clearances and land acquisitions. If all approvals are obtained promptly, the construction phase could begin soon, with an estimated completion time of two years. Environmental and Regulatory Approvals the project will require several regulatory approvals, including the critical CRZ clearance. 
these approvals are essential to ensure that the project complies with environmental norms and sustainable development principles. The land acquisition process will also need to be managed carefully to avoid delays and ensure smooth progress. Challenges and Mitigation Strategies While the project holds immense potential, it also faces several challenges. These include land acquisition hurdles, environmental concerns, and regulatory clearances. Effective stakeholder engagement and transparent communication will be crucial in addressing these challenges. Additionally, leveraging advanced project management techniques and adhering to timelines will be essential for the project's success. Conclusion The Marina Beach Ropeway Project is a landmark initiative aimed at transforming urban mobility and boosting tourism in Chennai. By leveraging advanced ropeway technology and fostering public-private partnerships, the project promises to provide a sustainable, efficient, and attractive transportation solution. Within the broader context of the Parvatmala Pariyajana, it reflects India's commitment to developing innovative infrastructure to support economic growth and improve the quality of life for its citizens. As the project progresses, continuous monitoring, stakeholder engagement, and adherence to regulatory standards will be crucial to realizing its full potential. With careful planning and consideration of environmental safeguards, it promises to be a valuable addition to the city's infrastructure, offering a blend of scenic beauty, efficient transport, and sustainable development. The successful implementation of this project could serve as a model for similar initiatives across the country, showcasing the transformative power of modern infrastructure in driving economic growth and enhancing urban living. Stay tuned for further developments on these projects. Do let us know your thoughts on the subject in the comments section. My friend, if you have found any value in this video, then kindly click on like button so that it will be recommended to other like-minded viewers and also as an encouragement to create better quality content. Please share this video amongst your family members, friends, and in your social media network so that this information might benefit others. Don't forget to subscribe to SciTech Buzz One channel so that you will not miss out on any of our forthcoming videos. Thank you.